Hi guys and welcome to another squad builder by myself Bateson87. Now I've been reading the comments of videos for the past couple of weeks and not a lot of people can afford the teams we've been building. But that's the thing I like about my channel. I can do a range of cheap squad builders all the way to very, very expensive and probably can't be beaten in price. Now, if you guys do want any MSP, PSN codes or cheap game codes, check out G2A.com. Their link is down below. If you're trying to hit over 5,000 likes, that'd be awesome and subscribe if you're not. So, what I'm doing today is a cheap-ish squad builder. Now, we're nine months into FIFA 15. 100,000 coins is pretty cheap. In my my opinion 100,000 coins is pretty cheap if you play divisions and tournaments as well um, you could get it done and you can earn 100k within uh, within a week of playing ultimate team depending on what players and whether you've got a pack addiction and like to spend it on packs so today we're going to be featuring two team of the season players and it's going to be in the region of around 80 to 160k that's the price range but I picked the team up for 100,000 coins and um, there and thereabouts depending on some of the players so it's, like I said it's going to feature two team seasons and one informed player as well so let's get on and build it in the goalkeeper position we start off in Liga Un uh, a, a cheapish goalkeeper as well uh, which is Lopez from Lyon if we look at him he is um, two on the market wow Two on the market, that's pretty rare. Didn't, uh, didn't expect to see two of him. Um, but then we, that, that's the first of the team season players out of the way. In the right-hand side, we do stick with Liga N and we go with Silver, who there is plenty of and very, very cheap also. And then in the right-back position, we do go with Silver, which is Mariano, the Brazilian, getting a strong link to Thiago Silva. This, um, this squad builder as well, guys, is a, a no lost links. No lost links, is that right? NLW. No links wasted. That's what it is. It's a no links wasted squad builder. And then um, that's the Liga undone. So moving on to the right side, we move over to La Liga where there is some cheap centre-backs. And uh, we go with Pepe who is the cheapest of the lot. I enjoy him. 73 pace, 84 defending, 83 physical. A very, very solid defender. In the uh, left back position, we actually move with uh, Brazil now. So we may as well put... Not Brazil, Portugal. So we may as well put Portugal in there. And... Get our left back, which is Ellis Sue. I like to play with him anyway. He's got a decent, uh, decent pace, decent all round stats actually. Um, if he had got a team of season version, more than likely he would have been in the uh, Arturo Army. 87 pace, 71 shooting, 71 passing, 77 dribbling, 71 defending, and 80 physical. Very, very nice player to have in the team. And then in the CM position, we actually move over to um, Croatia this time round. And uh, you know who it is the highest rated Croatia, second highest. Croatia player in the CM position which is our man Luka Modric at 87 rated he gets a strong link with Pepe and uh, the links aren't finished with him yet in the CM position we now move to Brazil uh, very very cheap player this guy and one of the best Brazilians in the game it is Ramirez from Chelsea I enjoy Using him, very rarely use him. I don't know why I don't really use him. I prefer to use Melo. But after using him in this team, he is fucking awesome. And I recommend you guys trying out Ramirez if you've not done so already. We then move up into the uh, cam position. And we go with an 86 rated cam, which a lot of people were hyped about um, at the start of this FIFA. And it was none other than... Uh, then, uh, where is it? Where is it? James Rodriguez, the 86 rated cam. Very good at going forward. Got a decent free kick. He's the best free kick taker in the team, actually. And uh, he gets a link with the striker, who is obviously the other team this season player. In the right wing position, we actually move over to Colombia. Colom, Colom, Colombia. And uh, it is our man Quadrado, the um, Chelsea version. Now, the reason we're going with the Chelsea version is to get a strong link with Ramirez and the weak link with the striker. And to finish off the uh, wingers, we actually have an Argentinian left wing, which which is Inform Gaitan. And to finish off the team, guys, we do finish off with the Colombian striker. Bloody hell, this has um, been moving around this. I should have built it separately. We go with uh, team of the season, Jackson Martinez. You can pick him up for a round having a look around between 50 and 75k so it does keep a bit of the expense off and uh, Guy Tani can pick up for around 13,000 coins and the rest of the team is a couple of k there and here and there uh, apart from Lopez obviously but I think there's going to be a lot more appearing of him on the market just because I'm doing the video quite early on in the day so guys leave a like rating subscribe if you're not this team is ridiculous I played against the likes of Ronaldo full team season teams and it did the job Quadrado's definitely a standout player um, but the two places we did put the team of seasons 
are the two places I wanted to uh, be strong. First one being the goalkeeper and the second one being the striker. So leave a like rating guys, trying to smash over 5,000 likes. Let me know what you think about whether this is a cheap squad builder of 100,000 coins with two team seasons and an inform. I think it's cheap for 100,000 coins but you guys may disagree. Let me know how many coins you have got in your accounts and uh, I may try and tailor a squad builder maybe a little bit cheaper than this uh, for you guys in the next couple of days. So leave a like, rate and subscribe and let's go and get into highlights we did get with this super, super 100k team. Now our first two games were against a full team of the year, full legend and full team of the season team all mixed together. Uh, no non-informs and this team caused a lot of damage. We did concede quite early on in the game but we did manage to get an equaliser there with Jackson Martinez. He wasn't really lighting the world on fire from it at this point which was very very annoying um, considering uh, how well he's the most expensive player in the team um, but then we started turning the team on. Now I was passing around with Modric, Ramirez and uh, Rodriguez, all three of them linked very very well and didn't pull them too far up the pitch. The reason I didn't do so was because I wanted to get the ball to Jackson Martinez who is very strong and uh, very skillful as well with his 4 star skills. Now if you're playing on the counter attack and you do use wing play, Gaitan 85 pace, 88 dribbling and also 4 star skill moves but medium medium work rates which is a bit of a downfall with him and uh, then on the right hand side you do have Quadrado with his 93 pace 87 dribbling and uh, also 5 star skill moves and high attack in work rate. Now with the defence just, just looking at the defence guys you're going to know there's absolutely no problems maybe the like, like, maybe the, the problem actually which does line in defence is the attacking left back and right back but when you got Pepe and uh, Sergio um, not Sergio Ramos, Thiago Silva there um, they, they've got enough cover by themselves to sort it out. Lopez as well this was the first time properly using Lopez didn't really concede many goals for me and uh, pulled off saves which I wanted, wanted him to anyway for any type of goalkeeper and uh, we did walk away with I think it was around 6 or 7 victories out of seven games uh, with this team and uh, it was actually nice and refreshing to play it with some uh, rare gold players because as you know if you've been watching the channel guys I've been playing with legends team of the years and everything else like that for the past couple of weeks just because of the team of the season hype I always do it at this time of year and uh, I will continue doing it with the best possible squad builders as well but if you want to see squad builders like this done in the future for the remainder of FIFA 15 let me know in the comment section below some budget some formations some cheap team of the season players I should use and uh, I'll try and bring out these uh, unbeatable squad builders for you so if you have enjoyed the video guys a like rate would be very much appreciated try and hit over 6,000 likes subscribe if you are not subscribed and if you do like expensive squad builders guys go and have a look around on the channel I'm sure you will find a load of them and also if you do like the best possibles um, which is my go to uh, squad builder series you can see that in the channel as well so until next time guys see you all later have a very very nice rest of your day